Finding out that you're about to lose your eyes is one of the most terrible shock. You may not know what it is like to live without sight. While nothing can take away this natural shock and grief, Dr. Franklin, the only ocularist in the country, makes custom-made eyes, which has given hope to many of his clients. Uh, I make and fit custom-made prosthetic, ocular prosthesis. They call them prosthetic eyes, fake eyes, mm. chiso chendiga. Uh, and for the chiso chendiga, the reason why they call it that is because sheep's eye, because before long ago it wouldn't move. You, it will be still. So if, if, if you look one side, this eye would stay there. Uh, but with a custom-made eye, you can get some movement. After one begins to wear that facial eye, it has to spend at least six months in the socket before it is removed. The doctor therefore has to take them through the whole cleaning process because it's very sensitive. During Shilanga's final visit to her doctor, she was taught how to remove, clean and put back her custom made eye. When she looked at herself in the mirror for the first time, it was overwhelming. The eye, the patient, I should make sure they not take it out and put it in because of the same reason, they have to clean it up. So, um, recommend that you, they use baby soap, shampoo, baby shampoo. So it's just cleaning, no scrubbing, so you just dip it into the shampoo with warm water, 10 minutes, get it out, it will be clean. He says that ever since he started doing this, he hasn't seen any patient express dissatisfaction. When, when it fit in the eye, the, the first three days, they feel the pressure in the socket. But that's good because the eye settles in. Um, so all of them, they're going to feel that pressure a bit to settle in. So that's the only side effect. There should never be pain. If there's pain, we're supposed to stop. Something's wrong. So the whole process, there's no pain, no cutting. Being the only ocularist in the country, he faces a number of challenges. However, the financial problems on the side of the clients is one of the main ones. The biggest is, of course, financial. The people can't afford. So we figure out a way to help them get the eye. Dr. Waswa is now training other people on how to make these eyes to reduce on the workload that he carries, though the learning process will take a while. Olivia Komgisha, NTV Tonight.